Tom Brady hits the fashion runway, the Bucks offensive coordinator Byron Leftwich goes old school, and the NBA lays down the law on ping pong. Yeah, Kyle Berger and Kevin Lewis are zooming us through the sports headlines. Kyle, never has a sports photograph been so drooled over than the release of Tom Brady actually in a Bucks uniform, no Photoshop. I feel like it's a less popular choice, but my favorite look is the pewter. Yeah, pewter, funny word, doesn't sound like a good jersey look, pewter. I think the cleanest, best look, I got to go the all whites. Okay, no, very clean. Well, Brady is going to be 43 when the regular season kicks off. Bucks offensive coordinator Byron Leftwich is 40, immediately classifying both guys as old school by today's standards. Leftwich excited to have another elder statesman in the room. We can talk a lot of football uh, from the past 30, 40 years. Uh, we just we just communicate in that way, and we just try to learn each other, figure each other out, so we can be at our best. Well, it's a good thing Rob Gronkowski lost his WWE 24-7 title belt because this week the company reported one of its developmental wrestlers tested positive for COVID-19. The wrestler was in the audience for one of the company's tapings at the Performance Center in Orlando. It's the second positive test for the WWE since WrestleMania was held April 4th and 5th when an employee who worked the event tested positive. The NBA is set to return to Orlando when teams report to the wide world of sports complex on July 7th. Last night, the league released a 100-page guide to what life will be like when play resumes. One of the biggest restrictions, no doubles ping pong. Adrian Wojnarowski, NBA insider, until directed otherwise by the NBA, players should play singles only so that they can maintain six feet of distance from each other. No word on if there are shuffleboard guidelines uh, in that book. That's Kyle Berger. I'm Kevin Lewis. We will see you next time.